Did you see my picture in the newspaper? My hair wasn't even combed! I haven't looked that bad since my driver's license. So you don't like to have your picture taken? Would you want your picture taken? If your hair was unruly and a complete wreck, may as well have been a month. That would have been better. I wouldn't say it's that bad. Maybe you could wear a feather duster on your head. Uh, anyhow, when did this fear of getting your picture taken start? Well, it all started when some crackpot scientist took a picture of me. Then he posted it on his crackpot website, crazycrackpotscientistlivingathome.com. But I don't think the correct term is crackpot. He had a formula for growing heads on his website. It shrunk my sister's head. I think crackpot sums him up pretty well. By the way, I think I actually saw this picture. You looked quite handsome. The way you were hiding your face seemed so natural like you meant to do that. I did! Still, I, I would like to compliment those big feet. You're what, size 30? I'm not sure. But you know what they say about people with big feet? So, back to the hair! <laughs> Why are you so conscious of your looks? Many yetis would love to hook up with a beast like you. Oh, they don't care about furs and toes. They only care about scales and claws. That picture made me look ferocious. And really, I'm just a fun-loving dancer from Toledo, Ohio. I see. And never since that picture was taken, has it changed the way everyone views you? Exactly, I've been trying to change my image with things like baseball and beef jerky. Have you ever thought that maybe trying to please other people with your looks, and not yourself, just can't make you happy? I never uh, looked at it that way before. Thanks, so. I never looked at it that way. Ha 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 